Hi, I'm Ken Kanapka, your instructor for lexicology, the study of words, online. In this short video, I'll walk you through the basics of the course website. Our course management system here at NEIU is Desire to Learn, or D2L. Many of you are probably familiar with D2L from other courses at Northeastern. But because the online experience requires you to interact through D2L exclusively, I figured I'd give you a short tour of the areas that'll be crucial as you get started. Let's start with accessing the course site. You can go directly to D2L at neiu.desiretolearn.com or you can get to D2L through your NEIU port page. You then click on the link to this course which brings you to the home page. The course news section of the home page is where I'll post updates and occasional news items. Every semester I can count on language turning up in the news in some way. If you see something relevant to the class, let me know so I can share it here. Be sure to read my introduction so that you know how to get started with the class. The first thing I ask you to do is go to the Resources tab. Click on the Resources tab and select Content. We'll begin Week 1 with Unit 1. Click on the Unit 1 Lecture, Welcome to the Online World, to find out how to complete the requirements for the unit. The Unit Lecture is where you will start each week. I discuss the important points for the week and outline the requirements for successfully completing the unit. The next link is to the Quizlet site. This site contains the words and base forms you will need for the unit. Each week, you'll go to the vocabulary list for the corresponding week, this week it's Unit 1, and review all the definitions. You'll be responsible for knowing the definitions of the words and base forms and will be quizzed on them each week. Next, look at one of the most important aspects of the course, the discussion forum. Each week, I'll post a topic for discussion and you're required to contribute a post to the forum. Your first post is due by midnight on Wednesday. You can find the criteria for successful posts in the Syllabus tab. Every Friday, I'll post a follow-up topic for discussion. This is generally a shorter post that continues the initial topic and calls on you to demonstrate your understanding of the unit. This is your chance to synthesize what you've learned and apply your critical thinking. This post is due by Sunday at midnight. As in the face-to-face -face course, a lively discussion makes for an interesting class. In our class, you'll reply to two of your classmates' posts in a way that continues the conversation. The details of my expectations are found in the syllabus tab, but suffice it to say that a simple, I agree, or that's interesting, will not cut it. You need to expand on the post and bring in new ideas to think about. All of this is covered in the documents in the syllabus tab. If you have questions about this, let me know. A good way to let me know is through the Unplugged Forum. This is a place to share questions and comments about the course. I don't grade this forum, but I monitor it so that questions that come up can be answered quickly by me or by your classmates. Think of this as raising your hand in class to ask a question that will be relevant to the entire class. Questions that are specific to you, such as grades or other personal items, should not be posted here. Those types of questions should be sent to me directly through the Communications tab. I've referred to the Syllabus tab several times. Let's go there and see what's what. The Syllabus tab is where you'll find not only the syllabus, but other materials that will help you stay on track. Many of your questions about scheduling and grading are answered in the materials here. Be sure to review the requirements for class discussions. This is an important part of your success in the course. 
review the syllabus to see the course schedule and how grades are determined. You'll also find a video that will take you through the basics of D2L. This will be especially helpful to those of you who haven't used D2L before. Don't forget to take the pre-course survey by this Sunday at midnight. One of your tasks in Unit 1 is to email me through the course management system. The way to do this is to go to the Communications tab and then the Class List and Email. Send me a note telling me a little bit about yourself and what you hope to learn this semester. By emailing me through the course site, your message will be tagged as coming from a student and will be treated as top priority. Finally, go to the link to the review quiz for Unit 1. You'll find a review quiz in each unit folder and you're required to take the quiz before Sunday at midnight of the corresponding week. You can take the quiz multiple times, but note that it will not be available after Sunday. The quiz will consolidate your learning and act as a review of the unit. We'll be taking advantage of other features of D2L and I'll introduce them to you as we go along. For now, you should have a pretty good idea of how to navigate the course site. The first week of the course gets you familiar with the online environment, but next week we'll start looking at the really interesting parts of the course. Words.